Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm sorry if you can notice my moon face. I think it's pretty noticeable, but yeah. Anyways, I just wanted to make a quick video today about uh, the Law of Attraction and what my thoughts are on it, pretty much. So, if you don't know what the Law of Attraction is, it's basically where um, <clears throat> you use the power of believing to manifest your dreams, like what you put out into the universe will come back to you type of thing. Now, um, I'm pretty sure a lot of people might mis like, have the misconception that it's like a religion, just like Buddhism, because it's not really a religion. It's just a way of life. Now, you might already guess what my thoughts are on it, and I'm not against it, okay? Uh, I know, like, it can be a little bit, like, crazy, like, how some people are really obsessed with astrology, you know, zodiac things. I mean, I do it for fun, and it's kind of cool to pretend, like, you know everything about another person without even talking to them, but, no. But, yeah, the law of attraction is something I do believe in. Like, it's just, like, karma. It's just happens in life. And I just want to talk to you and say that I've had some experiences where the Law of Attraction actually does work for me. Now, these are some simple things, maybe a coincidence, but I highly doubt it, honestly. Like, after a while, you just kind of notice that things just start building up better. Like, for instance, uh, one of the biggest signs that it's working is that you see the numbers 111 everywhere you go, and I do. I do. Every single day I look at the clock and it's 111. Like, I never missed it once. And let me give you an example. So one day, instead of saying, uh, oh, I really want, I, I really want chocolate. Like, eh, I want it, it's me, 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 you know. Uh, I was thinking, I really hope I get chocolate soon. And guess what? The next day, I did. Like, a lot. Of it, like a bag, like a paper bag full of chocolate. Like, I thought that was pretty interesting. I mean, maybe it was a coincidence, but uh, I don't know, man. Just like somebody's reading my mind, I guess. But it's definitely nothing like you, you can dedicate your life to it, but it's definitely not like some spiritual being. It is the way you think, pretty much. It has nothing to do with Jesus or God or Satan. It's not, I don't think it should be a sin. And if it is, well, call me a sinner, I guess. Now, if you're not for it, I understand. Like, sometimes it is very hard to manifest the things that you want the most because it takes the most time, I believe. So, like, mm, I don't know what I've been wanting. Well, recently, I was hoping to God that I, well, not God, but you know, the universe, uh, like, I need a job soon. Like, I really need, I really wish someone would call me back for an interview, and guess what? The next day, Olive Garden called me. Like, I'm not even joking here. I just think it's a very useful maybe and helpful on to like being more positive with your thoughts you know what I mean well I don't really think it's something uh, you can take it seriously but I don't think it's really anything people should worry about whenever someone mentions it I hope you didn't hear that but yeah I don't know you tell me what you think about it uh, yeah thank you so much for watching though and that's all I really have to say, because uh, I didn't write this down, I didn't plan it, really. I mean, I have, but no really big points I really wanted to mention here. I just wanted to tell you my thoughts, and I like it. I think it's very uh, refreshing to the soul, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, thanks. thank you so much, and have a good day.